Now, many Hoosiers are commemorating 9-11 with ceremonies and events. Some hold up the American flag for hours to remember all those who died. Charlene Criswell introduces us to one of them. Well, we're over on 116th Street in Fishers. This is where Gene Schwarzkopf stands on the bridge for 12 plus hours, but he's also joined by this man, Brad Lightcap, and he stands out here. And Brad, I want to know why you decide to come out here and join Gene and his family. Well, this is the way that uh, I choose to remember those that we lost on 9-11 in 2001 and honor those that serve our country, both in a military uh, fashion and as a uh, first responder. Now, wh why this way, I should say? You know, you we come out here, you stand with the flags, and it's a great display. You, we're hearing so many honks and home, so many people stopping by. What does it mean to you? Well, today's my birthday. Oh, happy and birthday. for the first couple of years after 9-11, it was very uh, challenging to enjoy the day. So uh, in 2003, I decided to come to the bridge and have been coming ever since. And you know now you're- a rewarding day to yeah. uh, honor and serve. There you go, and you're joined by a lot of people who also feel the same way about you and want to remember 9-11. What does it mean to you to really have kind of this this camaraderie behind remembering what happened on that day? It's nice to have a uh, cohesive group that's here for the same reasons. Not political, just a uh, good way to remember. Awesome. And you're going to be out here for 12 plus hours, right, today? That's, that's the plan. There you go. All right. Thanks so much, Brad. I really appreciate yeah. it. So again, 116th Street Bridge here in Fishers. They will be out here waving the flags. If you're in this area, you can honk, you can say hello. If you'd like an event, uh, list of some events that are happening in our area too, or that have had up in, in our area, you can go to our website. That's Lays from Fishers, Charlene Criswell. Send it back to you.